it down. Amen. Five, four. Thank you, John Gambling. Backstage with Peter Ladon. AM 970, The Answer, Sunday afternoon. You know, after the Tony Awards, a lot of the shows that were featured on the award show did extremely well at the box office. That's always the, the tradition. And the one in particular is the Brian Cranston show, All the Way, where Brian Cranston of Breaking Bad fame plays Lyndon Johnson. And um, they broke a box office record, all-time record, for a drama going almost to a million and a half dollars in sales in one week last week. So that's pretty extraordinary and good news for a show like that. Other shows uh, did uh, well after the Tony Awards, particularly those that won. And speaking of shows that won, last week on Backstage with Peter Ladon, we talked with Jamie DeRoy on the phone. Jamie is a well-known, highly respected, and much loved Broadway producer, performer, and as a matter of fact, Jamie, who is right here with us in the studio today, is one of the producers of the show that did in fact win a Tony Award, A Gentleman's Guide to Love and Murder. Jamie, welcome. Right, for Best Musical, we were very excited, and, and we didn't, we, we beat our own record, which uh, this, this week, which was over $901,000, we've never been that high. So it's, it's we, we love we love getting the Tony. It's it's great. It's just great for a show. Yeah. Is Tony Award winner Chuck Cooper? He's going to be bringing his show to Fifty Four Below, which is actually you know one of the wonderful new clubs of the last couple years. That's kind of broken onto the scene. Uh, Chuck won the Tony for the Life, but he's been in Carolina Change currently in Act One. And he's going to be doing a show called The Blues of Langston Hughes, and it's an evening of classical poems that are playing every Tuesday night at the Metropolitan Room on West 22nd Street for years now. 9.30 every week she goes there. Now, she was from Lambert's, Hendricks, and Ross. Did a great, great. For standards, do they do a Sinatra imitation, or is it just paying homage to? Uh, it's paying homage. It's not an imitation. Oh, great! great. Uh, I, I don't think they begin to to do that. Eric Comstock is a piano player who also sings, uh, but they they just it's it's a beautiful, wonderful harmonies. It's.